implementation of carbon reduction strategies these strategies aim to enhance carbon sequestration reduce greenhouse gas emissions and improve the sustainability of agricultural practices adoption of these practices can help mitigate climate change impacts enhance soil health and promote long term resilience in the agricultural sector and enhance the generation of carbon credits these strategies are implemented case to case through our nodal agencies regionally and with the expertise of internal team and the listed experts conservation agriculture conservation agriculture involves minimizing social disturbance maintaining soil cover and practicing crop rotation by reducing tillage implementing cover cropping and diversifying crop rotations farmers can enhance soil organic carbon sequestration and reduce carbon emissions from agricultural activities agroforestry Agroforestry combines trees or woody perennials with crops or livestock on the same land. Planting trees on agricultural lands increases carbon sequestration, improves soil health, provides shade and wind protection and diversifies farm income. precision agriculture precision agriculture uses technology and data to optimize inputs and resource management by employing precision planting targeted irrigation and variable rate fertilization farmers can improve nutrient efficiency minimize chemical usage and reduce greenhouse gas emissions nutrient management implementing precise nutrient management practices such as applying fertilizers based on soil testing and crop requirements helps minimize nitrogen losses and reduces emissions of nitrous oxide a potent greenhouse gas efficient water management efficient water management techniques such as drip irrigation sprinkler systems and moisture sensors can minimize water wastage and energy consumption while improving crop productivity and reducing greenhouse gas emissions integrated pest management ipm combines various pest control strategies such as biological control cultural practices and judicious use of pesticides by reducing reliance on chemical pesticides farmers can mitigate their carbon footprint and promote ecological balance livestock management livestock contribute to greenhouse gas emissions primarily through enteric fermentation and manure management strategies like improved feed quality methane capture from manure and efficient manure management can help reduce emissions from livestock farming renewable energy adoption installing renewable energy systems such as solar panels or wind turbines or agricultural lands can offset energy use reduce reliance on fossil fuels and lower carbon emissions associated with farming operations wetland restoration restoring and preserving wetlands on agricultural lands can enhance carbon sequestration and biodiversity wetlands act as carbon sinks and provide ecosystem services that support climate resilience and water management carbon farming carbon farming involves implementing practices 
specifically aimed at increasing carbon sequestration in agricultural soils. This includes techniques like biochar application, composting, and enhancing soil organic matter content through cover cropping and crop residue management. Methane capture from rice cultivation. Methane emissions from flooded rice fields can be reduced by implementing alternate wetting and drying techniques or intermittent flooding which minimize methane production while maintaining crop productivity. Manure management. Proper manure management techniques such as anaerobic digestion can capture methane emissions and convert them into biogas for energy production, reducing greenhouse gas emissions from livestock operations. Composting Implementing a composting system allows farmers to convert organic waste such as crop residues, animal manure and food scraps into nutrient rich compost. This reduces the need for chemical fertilizers, improves soil health and decreases greenhouse gas emissions from waste decomposition. Biogas Production Setting up anaerobic digesters can capture methane emissions from organic waste such as animal manure and convert them into biogas. Biogas can be used as a renewable energy source for on-farm operations, reducing reliance on fossil fuels and mitigating greenhouse gas emissions. Crop Residue Management Proper management of crop residues such as straw or stalks can significantly reduce carbon emissions. Techniques like incorporating crop residues into the soil, mulching or using them for bioenergy production help prevent open burning which releases carbon dioxide into the atmosphere. Recycling and reusing agricultural waste Recycling and reusing agricultural waste such as plastic containers, packaging materials or irrigation pipes can minimize waste generation and reduce the need for new resources. Establishing collection and recycling programs ensures proper disposal and reduces the carbon footprint associated with waste disposal. Controlled burning in cases where burning of agriculture waste is necessary, implementing controlled burning practices can minimize carbon emissions. Controlled burning involves carefully managing the timing, location and intensity of burns to reduce air pollution and optimize combustion efficiency. Integrated Waste Management Systems Implementing integrated waste management systems on agricultural lands involves adopting a holistic approach to waste reduction, recycling and disposal. This includes proper segregation of waste, establishing recycling facilities, promoting waste to energy initiatives and partnering with waste management organizations. Wormy Composting Wormy composting is a process that utilizes earthworms to decompose organic waste materials. It is an effective method for managing organic waste generated on farms, converting it into nutrient-rich wormy compost that can be used as a soil amendment, reducing the carbon footprint associated with waste disposal. Waste to energy conversion Installing waste to energy conversion systems such as biomass gasification or pyrolysis can help convert agricultural waste into renewable energy sources 
like biofuels or bioenergy. This reduces the reliance of fossil fuels, minimizes waste generation and reduces greenhouse gas emissions. Responsible Pesticide and Chemical Disposal Proper disposal of pesticide containers and chemical waste is essential to prevent environmental contamination and reduce carbon footprint. Establishing collection centers or participating in take-back programs ensures safe disposal or recycling of these hazardous materials.